Hey YouTube world, it's Ryan and Paul from Resell CMY. For those of you who don't know, we, we buy stuff and resell it on eBay for a profit. I've been doing it for probably over a decade, probably 12 years or so yeah. now, uh, part-time. Now we're probably like, we're still not like full-time, but I don't know, maybe 75% to full-time yeah. <laughs> around there. I mean, um, if we work full-time hours, that would be insane. Cause we oh yeah, we do way better. We probably work like 20 hours a week, something like that. Uh, we're going to do a weekend sales video for you today. We got 25 sales for 887, basically. Actually, we got 20, another one came through. Uh, so 26 sales for like 890, something like that. Yeah, 750. Maybe. I just didn't, uh, get the picture with the last one that just came through. Um, before we get into the sales, Paul, will give you a little cancer update. I did uh, chemo again on Thursday, which wiped me out until this morning. I was actually late this morning because I was throwing up, but uh, I'm starting to feel better. I'm coming out of the fog. I slept all day. Well, I got it Thursday. Friday was okay. Friday evening, I fell asleep, and I didn't wake up until Sunday morning on purpose because I felt like crap. And I'm just starting to come out of it, so hopefully I get a good weekend this week. And, and then they have no scan yet. No, forward. we're going to wait a couple more uh, rounds to get a good heavy dose of chemo in me before we get a good baseline on a scan. <clears throat> the He was scheduled for a scan weeks ago, but because the chemo had been so, like, they... Intermittent. Yeah, they'd, like, keep him from doing it for four or five weeks, and he went on vacation, so, so they basically pushed it. They want to get a, they a get steady... Right. Yeah. A steady regimen going. They want to they see get where I can the, take it, my max amount, where I can take this chemo and not go overboard where I can't take further chemo which was doing it before my side effects were so bad i couldn't do it as scheduled so they're waiting and waiting so now we're just lowering the doses until we find a happy medium where i can take it every two weeks like on schedule and kind of piggybacking off of his chemo there he had it thursday so thursday and friday he wasn't here to list no. and i pretty much didn't list either i did other things i brought the clean the watches brought all the watches like right like 55 watches to get batteries put in I did list stuff on Saturday and Sunday a little bit, so yeah, some of those of sales stuff. are on here, but still two days without Listing. just jamming out stuff. Our normal weekend for the past like month or so, I'd say, has been around like 1200 to 1400 mm -hmm. and so now we're just shy of 900 thanks to Paul. Thanks to this cancer. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, like I said, 26 sales, like 890 eight. 900 somewhere in there paul get us started yeah the first thing here uh this is our second one of these we you can see how old they are they have phase drugs on them and they've been marked down multiple times at three dollars and 95 cents but this is a vintage i should say because it's old uh old spice bottle aftershave this one's full six ounces twenty dollars plus shipping second one of those to go out yeah and i think we even had similar like six months ago or yeah. something or one or two that went out so twenty dollar bills you mind holding yeah. that up okay we got a large item here going out it's pretty cool uh it's tinkerbell this 42 inch ceiling fan i'll read all the thing disney tinkerbell fairies flush mount ceiling fan 2007 uh it is brand new in there um we opened it up and kind of made sure. made sure that it was new and then we wanted to include a bunch of pictures of it being new as well box is a little rough but uh ended up selling for 105 dollars and 59 cents so that's an awesome plus sale shipping. yeah plus shipping that's awesome sale North of $100 and that size getting oh, off yeah. the cabinets, which is always good, too. So this next great. one here is uh, That's actually one Mary of the Melodies. ones I did list. This is Bugs Bunny Armatron Musical Quartz Wristwatch. Just no band here on this one. This sold $10, free shipping. Okay. Uh, a couple videos ago, we had two ceramic animal heads going out. Uh, what was it? A bunny and a goat? Yeah, a rabbit. It combined for $100. This one's a little less desirable. It is a cow. A lot more common I've seen when I was listing them. Yeah, so we got it listed as vintage ceramic cow, bullhead, like a towel hanger or something like that. It has like glass, little glass eyes in it. Um, you got just another one to too. the wall. $17 plus shipping on this You're one. You're interested. We have another one for you. Do we have another cow one? Yeah. Oh, I'm 90% sure. I'm pretty sure. I thought, it, I thought, it, I thought we had uh, we have more of the other ones. Yeah. Pigs. All right, the next thing here is this, uh, boom, this is authentic. Authentic. I got a question and asked if this was authentic. I don't think anybody's duping these from 1979. Not for 
78, I said. 1978, I should say. This is a Garfield Fuzzy Hopper. This is a little wind-up thing, and they a little jump there. This is brand new from 1978. This sold almost 14 bucks plus shipping. $13.79 on sale. A lot of work for 14 bucks if you're duping those. Oh, I know. <laughs> what, what question is that? Um, we had a bunch of albums going out. We probably have them in all jacked up order. Billy Joel. The Stranger. Yeah, right here. The first one going out is Billy Joel, The Stranger. And these were all in nice condition. This was actually a pretty good one. $18 free shipping on that. Medium mail shipping for one pounds, three sixty-five. So we'll make uh, a little over fourteen dollars for that one. All right, this next order here is two of them. Uh, this is our third one of these to sell. If we find more, usually the packages fourth. are fourth. Mm -hmm. though usually the packages are destroyed. There's not many out there. Ours are the only ones on eBay. I don't even see anybody else selling these. These are Crystal. This is a Disney collect Crystal collection. This is Dumbo. And this one sold, I think this was 35 plus shipping, because that's what the other ones were. 32 uh, for that. Okay, and then and they uh, bought this also. Uh, what is this? Star Wars Red Royal Guards ROTJ 1998. This I'll was $10. Yeah, it's a good thing that we don't have like 40,000 subscribers, because if you were like, what is this? They would like oh, let you no off with the comments. We've had four of these crystals, and they're out of 1,000. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, so we <laughs> had sold a, four. Yeah, um, yeah. The pa when he one. said the packaging was shit on those, it's not even the box; it's the styrofoam, the styrofoam that's in there. It's deteriorating. Yeah, it just crumbles to nothing. Little it's black. Wet. It's all stuck to it. You gotta you wash gotta them. Clean it. Here's an awesome sale and a slightly disappointing sale. Yeah, we had Pink Floyd the Wall. This is brand new sealed. Had a movie hype sticker on it. Um, just, I mean, just awesome. I think it had like one little tiny nick in the plastic. Nick in the plastic up in the corner that we mentioned. We put it at auction. It did go for two hundred and five dollars and fifty cents. That was that's it, a great total. But when we were looking at it, we're like, man, I think minimum three fifty. Yeah, I was thinking six hundred. There was a couple that had like best offers of six hundred. And it didn't receive any bids like the last like day and a half. No. So right. if we had to do it all over again, we would have did it. Yeah, maybe a, yeah, start buy it now at yeah. three ninety nine or start the auction at three fifty. Typically, we do that. We start the auctions where we'd be happy to sell them. Right. We just thought that I I honestly thought that one would have the interest and get bid rate up. I it had forty nine so watchers on it too. There's I not like so lack too. people. It sucks too because we had that auction. Uh, I, I did a video with the little picture frames mm -hmm. that went up, started at like 20 and went up to $212. Yeah. It meant more than that. For little tiny picture frames. So I'm that. like, between that and the Pink Floyd thing, we're going to have like five, six, seven hundred dollars going into the paycheck next no. week. That but I'm still happy with it. I'm happy with it, but I thought it was going to be way more. All right, this next thing here, Ryan listed. This is a audio text phono stroboscope, strobe disc. It's vintage. It sold fifteen dollars free shipping. I have no clue what it is. I don't know either. But that sold free shipping. There was one that sold for fourteen with uh, plus shipping. One listed for around there. So I just listed it at fifteen with free shipping. It did have like a plastic covering that's still on it, so yeah. it's like brand new. Sold immediately. I'm like, okay. Should have raised. I'll it. take it. Same tote that uh, held that had one of these in it. Let's see, it's this one. Like it matters, they're basically the same thing. This is uh by Hewitt Hewitt Packard. Is yeah, that how Hewitt you pronounce Packard. it? <clears throat> Feed through termination. It's just this little piece that you can put on the end of a wire, uh, like a con for a connector. This one's 50 ohms, one watt. Uh, when I said tested, it's because it was new in its package, mm -hmm. um, and had stamps for tested. I didn't personally <laughs> test this little tip piece, but uh. $24 plus shipping. Yeah. And I had said free shipping in the description. I know I did. Oh, did so it's still sold. So they didn't say anything. But uh, they just, needed it. just one little piece out of the technology tote. We'll have another one here coming up. Next uh, sales here. There's two in a row going to be records. The first one's going to be 1975 History of America's Greatest Hits. And that sold $12 free shipping. Yep, so the next like one eight. is uh, the second one of these. This is Elvis Presley. Come on, everybody. This is new sealed. 
A vinyl LP, and that went twelve dollars. Probably shipping. the probably the worst title for an album you could possibly have. <laughs> Come on, everybody! <laughs> yeah. Come on, everybody! You too. All right. And then the next one of these. Yep. This is another Hewitt Packard. This is eleven oh ninety five A feed through termination, just like that one. This is six hundred ohms tested and working. This was twenty five dollars free shipping. Yeah. So boom. So Ryan quick. pulled fifty forty fifty bucks out of that tote quick. Yeah. Plus that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Plus that little freaking piece, so sixty, and that that that's been two years. I know, just sitting. There. I literally went and bought that when he had his liver surgery, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And uh, I found it. He bought it. I yeah, found he, it in the bed in the hospital in Albany. Yeah, in Albany, I found He's it. Like, here. Hey, go check this out. It was oscilloscopes, projectors. It was cool stuff, man. There was we made a lot of money on yeah. that. Yeah, and it was just a lot of big bulky stuff. I still got projector things and. Stuff out in the Remember garage. Those keyboards. Too. We had tons of IBM oh, keyboards. Oh yeah, those were good. Those were, there. Yeah, look for IBM keyboards in their box. Those was were good. Two to five hundred bucks. Yeah, all of them. And we were we paid four hundred bucks for that, right? Four fifty. Four fifty. The yeah, I know it was five hundred, and I was like, "What'd you take?" I beat them up for fifty dollars. And then we came home and sold the first two things for five hundred. It was two trips with my truck, though. That's awesome. So I mean, for four hundred fifty bucks. Yeah. And we, I, I wish we kept track of that because we made a bunch of money. Yeah, that was before I wrote yeah. it down in books and stuff. That was just when we were free that, it. It was cool stuff, though, too. I mean, it was just big and bulky. A lot of it was. Still going to have some stuff to list, too. Okay, this is the fifth one of these to sell. We have one more, I believe. 1995 Special Edition Ornament. It's Lucky from 101 Dalmatians. Disney, Walt Disney uh, Classics, Classics Collections. Eleven ninety five plus shipping. One more. Uh, next sale here, Ryan uh, found and listed a bunch of these small pins. This is a Crescent Moon uh, Skimitar, Sword Shriner, Masonic label pin. Yeah, it's like a Freemason. Yeah, this one Masonic sold $14 pin. free shipping on that little pin. And uh, <laughs> and that's without a back. It's still yeah. sold for that much, so that was cool. I'm surprised you found that one. I looked yesterday and it wasn't skewed. Yeah. Where was it? I just went drawer by drawer. Yeah. One of them, yeah. Yeah, I'll let Paul handle these. Oh, uh, this next sale. Uh, Got to refund the shipping. On refund those. the shipping, but this is uh, two train cars. These are the last seeds and stems of train stuff that we have. I've listed it all. It's all up there. It's my saying. It is his saying, but I love it. <laughs> but these two together sold $15 plus shipping. Okay, we had four of these swans. I think this is the second one to go out. Yeah. Lennox, China, Cream Swan. Stupid stuff you wouldn't think would sell. Yeah, just this little... Thing. I actually have it as a trinket dish based on someone else's listing. Which I guess... I mean, I had the pin in it. So right. A it's a trinket, trinket dish. It does have, like, tags all over the back. 24 karat. I know it's trimmed in that. Yeah, you can see, like, the 24 karat around the outside. But just stupid stuff like Hand that that we find in a tote. Karat. We list them up, and they eventually sell. $9 plus shipping. And 19 cents plus shipping. Uh, that's on a eight percent off sale. So two and more to go. For those. Same price. Uh, it's nine dollars and nineteen cents on these. Yep. These are nineteen eighty Star Wars. They're uh, candy toppers for a tube of candy. They're little heads, and uh, there's three of them in here: Darth Vader, Boba Fett, and uh, what's that hairy guy? And Chewbacca. Chewbacca. Uh, these sold nine nineteen <laughs> free shipping. <laughs> we sell Star Wars stuff years from now when we. Hit finally hit it huge on youtube you're gonna get lit up man i don't know star wars either. i've never seen it i've, I've, I just I've know never it. even seen one Neither. of them I, I saw the one. only star wars i've ever seen was like like if it's at mcdonald's and they name the person like that's the farthest i've ever been into any episode i've seen space balls though i've never seen that <laughs> uh i seen one star wars that was to be continued i saw an airborne school that's I've just because I was walking one. up and seeing every single movie that I was I don't even know place. what they do. Darth Vader's the bad guy. Luke, I'm your father. That's all I know. I've literally never even seen yeah, him in who's, it. Who's Darth Maul? Because we've sold... He's red. I yeah, know I know. But we sold his stuff. I don't know who he is. Who's he? Is if he's not dad? Darth Vader, Vader then, is it his uncle? I don't, could that, be. That, uh, Darth Maul, Darth Vader. Okay. Family name. Let us know how uh, stupid we are in the <laughs> yeah, comments. Yeah, please. Section. Okay, this one we got to remember to write the item number on the box. Yeah, they have a message about that. I thought, see that name, Small Familiar? Mm-hmm. It seems familiar. It does. It it's doesn't weird. have a repeat customer. I wonder if it bought off our other site. Well, they've said something like this before. We've yeah, I think like it's this. like the same people. All right, <clears throat> sidetracked. 
Four McDonald's, 1984 Ronald McDonald watches. Says Coca-Cola on them. I just listed them. Um, two red, two black. They're brand new. They didn't have a ton of value, so Paul lotted them up. $17 plus shipping. Happy to get rid of them. Yeah, happy with that. Uh, this next sale here that is a, cool a Fossil. This is limited edition. This is Cruzomatic watch. It's got a new battery in it. Here, I'll show you guys up close and personal. It's got a car in there. As you can see, this one does work as tested. We got new batteries put in all these watches. If Unless otherwise stated, new batteries in them tested are working. This sold $35 plus ship. Yeah, it costs us like a little less than $5 per watch. Right. It's $5 per watch, and they give us every sixth one. But free. how much does that save us from getting or returns? Ninth one. Honestly. Yeah, because with, with these old working. ones, even if they're brand new... Like we've had some that don't work. Yeah, maybe battery. like three, four percent of them that don't work. So then we just sell them for parts in that scenario. Okay, this again was in the eight percent off sale. This is uh, annual holiday Christmas. This is a retriever. We just dropped the price on that significantly too. Really? Because we put two more in there. Nine dollars and nineteen cents plus was that, shipping like on these. Bucks. Originally sixty nine dollars each. That's unbelievable. <laughs> I can hear your dog squeaking yeah. to come inside. Here, this two more records in a row here, guys. I'll go through them both. Ryan, I'll hold them up. There's First one's Phil Collins. Phil There's Collins. no jacket on this. No jacket required. LP. <laughs> that sold thirteen dollars. <laughs> you thought there was yeah. no dust jacket. Yeah, that's what I thought you. Yeah, the album's no jacket required, even though you it has that, a, even though yeah. it has a jacket on it. And the next one is this is the B fifty two self titled vinyl LP from Warner Brothers and that sold twenty dollars free shipping. Yeah, we That's got a good one. we got the uh, cover of that one covered with that that piece. Yeah, backwards. Oh, yeah, I do sometimes I flip them, but yeah, I sometimes these stupid things. This must be. I hate this guy as an actor. This guy, I can't yeah. even look at his face. He has like one of the most punchable faces in all of Hollywood. Jason Segel, but he's in the Muppets, and. That's probably why this is like their only DVDs that are left down there. Six dollars and fifty cents. We have like ten of these, and this is the first one to sell. Six fifty free shipping. Thanks a lot, Jason Siegel. Yes. Next one here is this uh, Ron Lee. Ron Lee makes a bunch of different stuff. We found out after selling, but uh, this is uh, more of a porcelain statue instead of his uh, carved rock and metal statues. This one's 1985 Shorty and Fleas, and that sold 14 bucks plus shipping. Yeah, it just Those had... other rock ones, though, they sell well. Those ones with the stone well, was... polished and all that. Well, yeah, especially if they're like the Looney Tunes. Yeah, ones that's what that I mean, had. compared to those. Um, that's the, We had two of these, and the other one sold, too. Oh, nice. Yeah, while you were down for the count. Uh, okay, and the last one that came through that wasn't acknowledged in the, the uh, total screenshot there... This is Dudley Do Right of the Mounties. It's just this mini lunchbox, and this had came with. Uh, is this fossil? I think it's a watch one. I'm not even sure. Yeah, it doesn't say fossil in mm -hmm. it though. I listed it. It doesn't. It might. It might just be. Uh, large tin? I think it just might be a mini tin. Usually these little tins that we have say fossil on them because they come with a watch. With a watch. But this one. I don't think did so. Seven fifty. Seven dollars fifty cents plus, plus shipping on that. So, yeah. So nothing else came through, no. right? Nothing. All right, that's it for the sales. You held it through that pretty good. Yeah, I'm good now. I'm getting better and better. Yeah. So. Yeah, freaking. Uh, we got uh, Aaron. My uh, my dad works with a guy part time. My dad's retired. He works with HVAC guy Aaron. He's coming over here shortly, probably next fifteen minutes, and gonna take a look at our shop and give us a quote on uh heating cooling unit so we can start getting that going forward yeah, david too. stopped by too by the way hey? yeah he stopped by saturday with another kid and two other guys in the back of the truck that to look at doing the concrete mm -hmm. out there and fixing his the stone yeah yeah so, well, did he give you a price or no didn't yet i haven't heard okay. back he just kind of looked at it dimensions talked about it Wanted to see if there was the other kid took the reins more than David did, but right. yeah, so we got some stuff going. When my my father gets back from Florida, he's a, get he's working. a union electrician. He he's retired now, but when he comes back from Florida, he's gonna help me run the power out there, and then uh, gotta get a floor and concrete, HVAC, and then the HVAC, and then, then spray, spray foam, foam and, then we're and then in the shop. Yeah, then we can start moving in. So. That'd be exciting. Be out of Ryan's be, house in our own shop. I'd be happy to work. Be. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. gonna be a place to go. Like, yeah, so we I mean, can have people over. 
All you resellers, we plan on once the shot's done doing a reseller rally up here. Just a little gathering if you guys want to come. A little gathering with kegs. Kegs. No one does kegs Clams anymore. Clams and kegs. Clams and kegs. And so, uh, plenty of land and fun to have. Um. Yeah, that's it for the sales. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Is there anything else you want to say? Yeah, I'm gonna go let the dogs in because they're screaming. Okay, we're gonna get all this stuff shipped. Thank you guys. All right, guys. See ya. Say resell CNY. Resell CNY. Said please like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe. <laughs> Say thank you. Thank you. And bye. Bye. Bye, guys. Right. Thank you. Bye.